It's Wednesday. It's March the 4th. Mm, I'm sitting on the couch. It's my day off. This is my 62nd vlog in a row. Imagine the things I could have done if I did anything good and productive for 62 days in a row. Guess I could have bought new shoes. Could have changed the oil. Or I could have got this crack fixed in my windshield. I could have gotten in shape. I guess I could have taken down the Christmas decorations. I could have grown a chia root. I mean, there's all kinds of things I could learn how to do. Like I could learn how to cook. I could have grown a beard. Ah, oh, wait, I did grow a beard. learn how to play the banjo. All right, so I think I made my point. There's a lot of things I could have done consecutively over 62 days, but I chose to do these vlogs. It wasn't easy, it's not easy. It only started off as a 30 day challenge. Remember that? Yeah, kind of messed that up. But here's the point of, I guess, what I'm trying to say. For 60, she's gone. For 62 days, I did a vlog. I never phoned one in. I did the best I could to tell a different story every day. It's a good challenge. I enjoyed it. I didn't convince myself. So, there's a challenge that anyone has out there for themselves. I encourage you to do it, whatever it is. It doesn't have to be this stuff, obviously, but I mean, if it's to work out for 62 days, maybe I'll do that next. To sing lullabies for 62 days, whatever. Just do it. Start and finished. That's it, I'm out of here. I'll see you all uh, tomorrow for day 64. Hey, St. Patty's Day is coming up. I mean, there's all kinds of things I can learn how to do.